Hey, it's Harry here. Welcome back to another video on my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be going over how to make money using JVZoo. So if you're looking to get into food marketing and perhaps you want to start making some money on JVZoo, this video is going to go exactly how you could start making money on JVZoo as a complete beginner. And also, I'm going to share with you two strategies that you could use to make money on JVZoo with free traffic. So if you don't have money to spend on advertising and you want to start getting into the money without having to you know, invest money up front, this video is gonna go over exactly how you could do just that. So I'm very excited to, of course, share this information with you. If this is the first time that you're on my channel, I'm always putting out new videos Monday through Friday that will show you how to, how to do affiliate marketing, how to create a, a passive income, how to grow an online business, all the type of type of stuff is right on this channel. So if you, if you haven't already done so, make sure that you hit the subscribe button down below Take the bell icon, and this way you'll be notified of all the new videos I post on this channel. So without further ado, let's get right into things. All right, so now I'm currently on the jbzoo.com website. Looks like they have a bit of a uh, different interface from when I was last on here. So it looks like they've, of course, updated things a bit. But the very first thing that you're, you're going to want to do when you get started with jbzoo is you will want to go ahead and create your free account. If you haven't already done this step already, what you'll want to do is go to jbzoo.com, click on the button up here that says start for free and then just go through the process of getting signed up. So this step is pretty self-explanatory, you know, fill in some basic information, name, email, all the type of stuff. Pretty much the same uh, concept as when you sign up to any other website. So what you want to do is create your JVZoo account. And then once you do that, then you could of course, you, you can go ahead and get logged in to the platform right there. And that is when you could start looking through the different offers that they have. So I'm actually going to go ahead and log in right now real quick. So I'm going to log in real quick. And then once you get logged in, it, you'll be taken to this page right here where, where it'll show like, you know, the you know, like the overview. Um, and then on the on the main page, it'll show like your earnings as of today and the day before. So um, if you want to find products to promote on Warrior Plus, on, not on Warrior Plus, on JVZoo, I keep mixing up the two. Um, what you want to do is you want to click under this affiliate uh, section right here. And then you want to go to the section that says find products. And this will bring up a list of products on the JVZoo platform, of course, that you could you could actually market on JVZoo. So the question is, what exactly does JVZoo have to offer in terms of their product selection? So JVZoo, I'd say, is primarily geared towards, um, you know, pr uh, pr products that, that are in like the sort of the make money online slash online business type of niche. They got a few other categories that you could, of course, look at as well. Like there's, um you know, cooking, there's education, there is like... Um, some health, health and fitness stuff, but I'd say majority of what's on here is in the business slash finance niche right there. So uh, right here, it shows a list of the different offers that uh, are currently, um, you know, selling in here. So we've got this one right here, uh, Video Maker FX. And then right here on the right, it shows like some of the stats in terms of how well the product is doing right there. So um, it's sold over, it looks like 30, 37,000 copies right there. Conversion rate, 2.83% EPC. Um, 1.42 average price is 5005 and then the commission payout uh, for this would be like a 50% commission. So, if you were to sell this product right here at $50 right there, you could uh, get a commission of around 25ish dollars right there. So, not bad. Uh, that's for, you know, that's for of course one single sale. And most of these products, you know, they pay out commissions that are like um, you know, 30 to 50% you know, most of the products being around, you know, 50 bucks or maybe like a little bit less. So uh, for each sale that you can get, you usually would get around like 20 to 30 bucks in commission. So not bad. But if you want to, of course, promote some of the products, what you first want to do is you will want to um, request approval to, you know, get access to the product first. So unlike a lot of other affiliate marketplaces, like I know ClickBank, for example, uh, you can go to it and you can literally get your affiliate link, you know, right away. With JVZoo, it's more on, you know, the stricter side where you have to first request approval from the vendor before they actually give you permission to uh, promote their product. So in order to get your affiliate link, you'll want to click on this button right here that says request approval. And then you'll, uh, it'll ask, um, you could then write like a message to the owner right there. So like if I scroll down here, you could leave, you write like, like something in here, like, you know, like, hi, I would like to promote this offer. May I have an affiliate link? So you could either say something along those lines, or if you have an idea on how you're going to go about promoting this offer, you could say, like, um, you know, I, I'm planning on doing, yeah, I'm planning on doing 
a review on YouTube or like a website, you know, so if you um, are planning on like doing a, a, a review, you could of course say that. And then in most cases, they will give you access to actually promote the product right there. In some cases with, I know like a lot of the higher ticket offers on here, uh, they may be a bit more um, selective on who they allow to promote, promote their products because they don't want just anyone and everyone to promote their products because they want to make sure that, you know, people are of course representing the products as well. So that kind of brings me to my uh, next thing that I wanted to say about this is that if you're going to promote anything online, I always recommend that you want to make sure that it's something that uh, is of rather quality. You want to make sure that the product that you're promoting is good. You don't want to just promote anything and everything. And you want to make sure that um, you have a great strategy in place to promote the offer. So I'm going to get into, into that in a you know a bit later, actually. But um, if you want to actually check out the product yourself, you can, of course, view the sales page. And this is, of course, where you could uh, check out you know more about what the product is off, uh, all about right here. So Video Maker FX, it's bringing that up. And then this, of course, it looks like it's about... Um, you know, it's about like a, you know, video type of editing software right here. So it looks like that's what it's all about there. So mo no monthly fees, no annoying wa watermarks, no costly software or months learning. So looks like this would be something that uh, would be great for people who are creating, you know, YouTube videos and they want to edit their very videos really very well. So something that I would actually recommend is if you have the funds to do so, I would, ac I would highly recommend actually buying the product yourself, testing it out and making, making sure that you feel it's something that is of rather quality. So I just cannot stress that, that enough. You want to make sure that you promote uh, stuff with moral authority. Authority. There is too many people that, you know, they get into this, they grab their affiliate link, and then they just decide, okay, I'm just going to spam this all over Facebook. That's really not the way that you want to be going about this. So you want to make sure that whatever it is that you're promoting is of rather quality. All right, so with all, all that being... Uh, all that being said, uh, the question is, how exactly do you go about promoting products on Warrior Plus? So there are a few ways that you can, of course, go about this. What I personally recommend is that you start with free traffic methods. Um, you can go the, the option of doing, you know, like paid ads. You could set up like a Facebook ad. You could do, you know, like, you know, Bing ads or Google ads or something like that. However, if you're promoting products that are rather in the low ticket range, that'll pay out, you know, maybe like 20 bucks per sale, um, It it's going to be... Um, it may not be as easy to break even uh, from your ad budget as if you were promoting like a high ticket item. And most of the products that are on, you know, the JVZ platform, they pay out rather low commissions. So for that reason, I would recommend sticking with free traffic, at least when you're first starting out. So there's a few ways you can, of course, go about this. The very first method that I want to go over is doing SEO. Now, you could either set up a website to do this. You could, you know, put out articles. You could review products, you know, on like a website. Or uh, what you could also do is you could set up a YouTube channel. So here I have my YouTube channel that I'm of course building up right here. And what you'd want to do is, you know, when you pick your niche that you're going into, like for example, if you're going into the make money online slash online business type of niche, you can create videos about, you know, different ways of, you know, making money online or how to do affiliate marketing. Um, or if you're going into like the health and wellness niche, you can create videos about health and wellness. But what you want to do is you want to ideally uh, focus on putting out valuable content that, of course, helps solve a big, um, you know, uh, problem that people are, of course, you know, looking to solve. And then in your video descriptions, you could then provide links to where someone could check out any of the offers that you, of course, recommending. So um, you could either go that way, or if you want, you could also go the option of reviewing products on JVZoo. So like, for example, we were just looking at, um, you know, Video Maker FX right here. And if I uh, search up on YouTube, um, you know, Video Maker FX review so i could search this up i'm sure that i'll find a, a few different um videos that pretty much go over what it's all about right there so these are a few people that have, have of course reviewed this offer right here and then in their um description as you can see here they got like a link to where someone could actually pick up the product right here so it looks like these videos as you can see they don't have that many views however when someone searches up something like product name plus review they're very likely in that buying mode. So con considering that this is like, you know, like a good product that people are interested in, uh, you know, they get lots of value from the video. And let's say that they decide that they want to actually check out the product. They could go in your uh, video description. You know, they could check out whatever offer that you uh, are, of course, reviewing there. And if they buy the product, then you get paid at that commission right there. So YouTube SEO is, I feel, one of the best ways of really going about this because uh, when, when people actually see a video, they connect with you much more and also for reviewing products i'd say this is really the best way to go so i i highly i really cannot uh 
uh, I recommend uh, YouTube SEO enough because I feel like it's one of the most powerful strategies when it comes to getting traffic to your offer. Now, uh, this isn't going to be, you know, like necessarily like, you know, fast overnight, you know, traffic where you put out one video and immediately you just become rich. This is something that you, you ideally want to be putting in uh, consistent effort in. The more consistent consistent you are with this, the more you're going to make in the long term. So this is a great traffic source in the long term if you are willing to, of course, put in the work. Another method that you, that you could, of course, go about this is with Facebook. So Facebook is the largest social media platform online. And there are like, you know, millions, if not billions of people um, on Facebook right now. In fact, as you're watching this video, there's probably like half the world's population uh, could be on Facebook right now. So it's a very great um, platform to, of course, leverage. But what you want to do is you want to go, uh, you want to find groups that are in the niche you're going into. So, for example, if you're going into like the, um, you know, like the business niche, right? Uh, business or like affiliate business marketing. You could uh, join one of these groups. So I just searched that up there. Um, let's see. So I'm currently in this group right here, the uh, Affiliate Business Marketing Group. And this group right here has over 88,000 members right there. So that's 88,000 people that you could actually connect with literally with, you know, your computer or even, you know, your smartphone. You could send out messages. You could create content in, in these groups. And this is a great way to connect, connect with people that are interested in the same type of stuff that you are. So you could join groups like these. Uh, you can create content, you can put out videos on, uh, you know, inside of these groups, and you could share information that you're, of course, learning. Or what you could also do is when you join a group, you could actually connect with people one on one. So this strategy that I'm, I'm actually going to be going over here is I feel very great for people who are just getting started. Let's say that you don't have a, you know, like a massive following. Let's say that you don't have a budget, a budget to spend on advertising, and you want to start connecting with people one on one. This is a great strategy to consider leveraging because it's a great way to get into the results rather quickly. So it uh, looks like this is, of course, taking a bit to uh, load up here, but it looks like the uh, admin of this group, they're promoting some sort of like uh, water type of thing right there. Um, so that's cool. But if this thing wants to just load up, that'd be great. Come on. Why is this thing loading so slow? Come on, like load up. So right down here, we see where it says uh, like the amount of like members. You can click on this link right here. And this will take you to where you could actually see who's actually in this group right here. So you could um, so you see like, you know, the admins. And if I scroll down a bit more, it'll show like, you know, like, uh, you know, your friends that are in this group as well. So I got a few friends that are in here. Uh, members with things in common. Uh, members living in your uh, local area. There's pages that like this group. And then there's also people that are new to the group. So you can see that like right now, uh, as the time, you know, at the time that I'm, of course, recording this video, like we've got like a few people that, you know, of course, joined this group an hour ago. So we've got like, um, you know, like this uh, Rebecca uh, person right here. So what you, what you could actually do is you could uh, connect with pe these people one on one. You could send out a message. You could say, you know, hey, Rebecca, for example, you know, in Messenger, you know, hey, how's it going? Uh, you know, I like to connect with like minded people. And I noticed that we hang out in the same group. How, you know, how are things going? You can send a message like that. And then. You know, if they, if they actually respond, you know, hey, you know, things are going great. How about yourself? You could say, you know, that's awesome. And then you could ask, you know, what is it, what is it that you currently do online? So you could let them respond. And then once they do, you know, you could say, you know, something along the lines of, hey, you know, hey, that's awesome. You know, I just found this great, um, you know, just started this new project with a few top income earners and it's duplicating very well for myself and my team. Let me know if you'd like, to, you know, to uh, check it out yourself. And if they say yes, then you could, of course, ask for their email. And then you could uh, enter that into the um, into your uh, list right there. So the only thing that that I'd uh, actually recommend getting is um, you could um, you can get your autoresponder. You could either use like Aweber or like GetResponse. Uh, I personally use Aweber, but uh, even if you don't have that, you can always send the affiliate link in a, in, in a message. However, I know Facebook uh, they are kind of strict when it comes to sending out uh, links in you know on Facebook or even in messages. Now they're extremely strict about that. So what I would actually recommend is you want to pick up a software such as, you know, like um, Aweber. So I use Aweber personally. And this is where you could actually follow up with people through email. So uh, all you really need to do with this is you just need to set up a um, like an email list, you know, like an email sequence of, of you know, the, the product that you're of course promoting. So like, for example, if you're promoting like 
uh, some sort of like training that shows like how to market online or how to get in a better shape. You know, you could, uh, you could of course, message people and then talk about, you know, like what you're, you're of course, learning or, um, you know, what you're going, currently going through. And if they express interest, then you could ask for their email. And then if they, you know, they provide that, you could, you could then put it in your email list there. And then you could, of course, follow up with them. So that's another really great strategy that you could, of course, use. And that doesn't really take, you know, any investment up front. Um, and also, it's one of the uh, faster ways of getting lots of high quality traffic. So the benefit with Facebook is that you can get people, you know, when you when you, of course, connect with them one on one, and they actually, you know, get, you know, get to know you, then it's the, these people who, you know, by the time that they see your offer that you're promoting, they're going to be much more qualified in, you know, wanting to learn more about, you know, what it's all about rather than, you know, the average person who just, you know, buys traffic, sends it to, an, to a link and then hopes that they make money. I mean, personally, you know, you can go that route. But I highly recommend starting with free organic tra uh, traffic strategies like, you know, you could either uh, leverage YouTube SEO, which is primarily what I'm focusing on, or you could even go on Facebook. You can, you can connect with people one on one and then you could provide them with your solution. So if they are interested, then you could, of course, send them your link or you can get them on your email list right there. So those are the two ways of getting free traffic. Uh, for uh, uh, JB Zoo. Hope you found this helpful. If you did, be sure to let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Give this a thumbs up because it really does help the channel. But if you'd like to learn more about how to build a profitable online business uh, through affiliate marketing, then my very first link down below will give you access to a free training that will go over how to build a profitable business online through affiliate marketing. And also not just that, but how to leverage an ecosystem where you could earn from multiple sources of income. So here's the last thing that I want to mention about JB Zoo. JVZoo is a great program to, of course, check out. They've got tons of great products in here that you, of course, look through. And you can make, you could definitely make a lot of money on JVZoo. However, the problem with JVZoo is that a lot of the products in here are rather low ticket. You know, you get like a $20 commission for a sale. And then after that, you don't really get anything else. So whatever upsells that are inside, you chances are you won't get, you know, anything on the back end as well. So that's kind of the downside with JVZoo is that you can make a lot of money. However, if you can make you know more money for the same amount of, amount of effort, then I definitely recommend going that route. So if you want to learn exactly how to do that and how to create a profitable business online through affiliate marketing, then my very first link down below will give you access to that free training right there. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this video and take care.